Hello YouTube world. Today is Thursday and normally I don't make two videos in a week but after the evening that we have had I decided that today was a great time. No time like the present so instead of making a video next week about this and not having all the details correctly, here we go. So, um, I'm a little frazzled right now. Just as my little baby is. Um, I decided to get a hedgehog for our family last Friday. Sometimes I always, not always, sometimes I don't make the best decisions, but I thought, <sighs> we'll get this little baby. He'll be easy to take care of. It's not like a cat where we have to change a litter box. I mean, he does have a little litter box, but um, not like a dog where we have to take him on walks. So, the danger of having an animal like this, though, is that they're small. And the hedgehog decided that, well, my daughter put him on the floor, that he would like to crawl into this tiny space that my ex-husband Lovely, there's some men out there that never finished their house projects. And the hedgehog that is like this big decided that he was going to crawl down this narrow little tunnel, which I thought was going to be a perfect plan for him. I was, just saw it coming. Didn't catch him in time and almost had him by a little leg, but I didn't want to hurt him. So he was under there for almost an hour. My four year old standing there the whole time saying, like, and my 10 year old and I are trying to keep it together and not cry. So here he is. He likes to be held in a little ball and right now he's a little nervous so I'm trying to calm him down. It's okay. I love you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you were stuck behind there. I love you. I'm very sorry. So, if you have a small pet like this and you want to make sure that they're safe, don't let your small child put them on the floor if you can't be around. I was hoping that this wouldn't happen, but after brooms and mop heads and hangers and trying to unscrew the bottom part of the dishwasher off so I could barely reach him, I finally decided that I would try a vacuum and just scare him, which I didn't want to do. <laughs> but I got him out when he's here. And I love him. And he's a cute little ball of energy. <laughs> and I promise that I will keep him safe and be a good pet parent from now on and forward. So here he is. He's a little crazy. And he just wants to go back in his cage. And he likes to be on my shoulders and on my back. <laughs> so this is it. Um, my hedgehog is a little crazy. But he's a little ball. And he has tubes and all kinds of things for food that he enjoys and he's just a little baby and I love him and this is what he looks like when he's calm and this is what I feel like when I'm calm after I finished getting a hedgehog out from under a kitchen appliance. I'm sorry. I'll go back down in your cage where you're safe because I've been a terrible parent today. <laughs> Hi everyone, have a great week. This is my baby, signing off. See you next Tuesday.